thinks you're Santa Claus. <laughs> I am. You know what? I know. Know what? The secret. What secret? Santa Claus. I've known for a long time. He's not real. Says who? My mom. They say that seeing is believing. <laughs> but the truth is, the world is held together by things you can't see. There really has to be something you want for Christmas. A house, a brother, and a dad. That's all I ever want. He loves you and he wants to kiss you. And he thinks he's the most beautiful woman in the whole world. If you're really Santa Claus, you can get it for me. Right. It's an engagement ring. If, if you can't accept anything hey! faith, then you're doomed for a life dominated by doubt. She's deaf. You don't have to talk to her. She just wanted to see you. You are a very beautiful young lady. <laughs> if I could make you believe, then there'd be some hope for me. If I can't, well, I'm finished. I want this man declared insane. This is about a man who has had something very wrong done to him. I want you to help him. Together, we're going to prove that there is a Santa Claus and that you're him. I'm ready, girls. Do you believe that you are Santa Claus? Yes, of course. <laughs> I'd like the court to see Mr. Kringle make the reindeer fly. He only flies on Christmas Eve. <laughs> Coles believes in Santa Claus. Do you believe in Santa Claus? If this court finds that Mr. Kringle is not who he says he is, then I would ask the court to judge which is worse, a lie that draws a smile... I knew it. ...or a truth that draws a tear. 20th Century Fox. Richard Attenborough. Elizabeth Perkins. Dylan McDermott and Mrs. Doubtfire's Mara Wilson present you with the most precious gift of all. Something to believe in. Miracle on 34th Street.